was saying that Ajit Pawar will become the next CM of Maharashtra. Is there any sources said to you this? No, look, I can't reveal my sources. I have uh, talked about it long time back, about 15 days back, immediately after the uh, split in the NCP happened. It's just an analysis uh, based on some information, but it's an only analysis, that the anti-defection decision against the Ikna Chinde group, which is pending before the Honorable Speaker of Maharashtra Assembly, will have to be delivered within the 90-day period defined by the Supreme Court in another matter. And this matter was remitted to the Speaker of the Supreme Court, Speaker of the Vidhan Sabha by the Honorable Supreme Court on about 11th of May. So 90 days from that date is about 10th of August. So I think the decision will have to be made by that time and there's no way uh, the Shinde group can escape this qualification because they have clearly violated the 10th schedule. They're not merged with another party. So they stand disqualified and the position of Chief Minister will become vacant either around 10th August or any time before that, beginning tomorrow. Now, interestingly, uh, the Chief Minister went and called on the Prime Minister with his family. Normally, these visits happen immediately after he's appointed. This visit happening after one month, uh, after one year of his working as a Chief Minister has raised eyebrows. There was a resolution in the Assembly passed praising his work after one year, which indicates it smells of uh, farewell. But what should the uh, faction do? That same thing done by the Ajit Pawar faction also. If Shinde faction disqualified, then automatically if Jan Patel or others will file petition, Ajit Pawar faction also disqualified. No, no. I don't think if they had to file the petition, they would have filed a long time back. So I don't think... Uh, I don't know what's happening in NCP, but uh, they had enough time to file a petition. They are not filed, so I think there is some reproach going on between the two groups.